die. Oh, oh my god, it's so spicy. Woo! Right? Uh, the worst item we have. No, I'm scared. Hey, hey guys. guys, welcome back to channel, it's me Austin. And I'm Lexi. And today we're going to be trying exotic snacks from around the world. We spent over $200 on these exotic snacks. Some of them look really good. And some of them look really bad. Like mayonnaise chips. If you like mayonnaise, jam. But let's jump right into it. First up, we're going to start with something I shared on Instagram the other day. Three in one lates. Buttercorn, caramel, and cheddar cheese. These Lay's chips are exclusive to Thailand. Oh. So each one of these are different. I had the caramel flavor chip. Mine tasted like feet. Hold on here. That was buttercorn. What was that? Oh my God, that was like despicable. What was that second flavor? I don't know. That was definitely, that was corn. It's corn. Lexi has a phobia of corn. No, I'm not even joking. I have, I, I can't with corn. Can you find a butter corn? Chip? What? No wonder I spit it out. I thought it was like buttered popcorn, but it was like literally butter corn. I was like, why is this disgusting? Uh, Thank uh, you. Thank you. Like corn on the cob. Corn in cob form. Okay, so let's try jello sour candy squares. I want the blue. Blue makes food taste better. These smell really good. It has no flavor. There's not a lot of flavor in it. I love these. There's no flavor in the blue. I give these a five out of 10. I want to make you jump a little. What? This is probably- <laughs> No. Yes. No, I don't want to- This is the worst item we have no, today. I'm so scared. It is from Thailand, the mayonnaise lace no, chip. Uh. You just cursed it. Uh, no, I'm scared, please, please. Please. That is... I'm psyching myself out. Mayonnaise flavored chips. Definitely a skip. A solid two out of 10 for me. The fact that you even gave it points is terrifying. I would give that a negative five. Skittles gummies. We got two different flavors. So these are Chinese Skittle gummies. Mixed yogurt flavor. This is like an original. The yogurt one is actually kind of fire. Eight out of 10 fire. These on the other end, four. I'd also give it a four. Lay's Max Wasabi Edition. Wasabi Mayo. Why? What's with the mayo, Lay's? This is also from Thailand. Why does it smell like the other bag of mayo chips? Why? Can I tell them that? Yeah. So the camera died as we were about to try the wasabi chip. And now Lexi, tell them what happened when I came back outside. Okay, so when we started this video, there was like the sound of people talking. Like it sounded like somebody was playing a video. And I was like, is that coming from my phone? Checked my phone, nothing was playing. And I'm like, is something coming from your phone? He was like, no, it's the neighbors. And I was like, it literally sounds like it's coming from like right here. What do you want to start with? What? I'm telling you, it's so loud. Dude, it won't pick it up on this. Like, look, if you stay quiet, it doesn't I'm pick blind. it up. It it's doesn't okay. pick it up. I walk inside, I pull my phone out of my pocket. It's been playing reels the entire time. So, the entire time that we were shooting, that whole half of the first video, reels were playing in Austin's pocket. Oh, I'm ready to try this wasabi chip. Can I get a skip? No. You're gonna hate it. Did you never try wasabi? Oh, yeah. no. My tongue's burning! My tongue! You know would calm your tongue? Your Hold up. This I would give a one out of 10. I actually didn't mind it. If you like wasabi, this is like not a bad snack. All the way from Japan, we got the exclusive rose petal lays. Breaking news! We have a brand new Snapchat show live right now. Where can you find it? In the description below. What's the feature? 
us. Doing what? Fun things. Uh, what do you think rose petals taste like? Rose petals. Yeah, but what do what do petals taste like? I don't know, dirt. <laughs> I thought it was gonna come out of the can like a Pringle. Oh. Oh my god! This is how they look. It looks like a whole grain chip. There's no like specific smell to them. There, it's such a light scent of rose petal. I'm not... Hmm. What was that? Like tangerine, yeah. or like an orange. Like some kind of fruit. Like citrus. I, I had like a, yeah. A citrus. The aftertaste of this, like toward the end, it starts tasting like a fruit, like citrus fruit. I'm very 50-50 on these. If you could somehow get your hands on these, try them and let us know what you think the flavor is. I'm a little thirsty. This is the only drink we have. This is Little Baby's Ooh Wee Lemonade. Ooh Wee. Cotton candy flavor. It's from a brand called Rap Snacks. They produce a bunch of snacks and drinks all for rappers around the US. And this one's a little baby, so let's just try it. Tastes just like cotton candy. 10 out of 10. <laughs> you scared me. Don't look at me when I'm drinking it. Bombastic. <laughs> nah, I, I take back my 10 out of 10. I give it 8 out of 10. Easter's next weekend. And we got some Chips Ahoy Cadbury eggs. Actually, I just realized by the time this video will be uploaded, Easter will have just passed. Can I just say that these eggs, the regular ones are like my favorite chocolate ever. They're so good. They don't taste like normal chocolate. It's advanced chocolate. What are you doing? Stop. No, no, I'm sorry, I got excited. <laughs> Lexi always has the tendency when she gets excited for food that she'll open it the wrong way. <laughs> Ooh, bam. It's just a Chips Ahoy cookie. There's little eggs inside along with the normal chocolate chips. I'm disappointed. Maybe my tastes are too fine. No. <laughs> it's a really good cookie if you just want a Chips Ahoy cookie. I'm disappointed with how exotic it actually is. I'm on my period right now, so I should think anything is good. So, what? Yeah, these two go hand in hand. I'm this, scared. This is what the guy told me. They're both from India. One is India's magic Masala. That actually sounds And this good. one is West Indies hot and sweet chili. Yeah, have you ever had Indian food? No, I have not. That's, yeah. I got the smallest chip in the bag. Oh. Why is it spicy? This tastes like eggs. Oh, oh my God, it's so spicy. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Oh, God, I hit you like five seconds later. I give it a zero. I give it like a six out of 10. <laughs> Do I have to? When he grabs it, I almost told him to put it back. Double I'm gonna do crunch, it for you guys. Ultra quo quantes. I'm scared. I'm not doing it. I can't, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I can't do it. I can't do it. I, I love you guys. That's ketchup in a bag. It's not that bad. I psyched myself out too. And I was like, it's literally just ketchup, it's fine. <laughs> it's, it's, like, it's just ketchup, it's, it's fine. Like sweet. I mean, they were pretty gnarly, not gonna lie. <laughs> Can I try the mayo ones again? What if somebody kidnapped me and they told you that the only way to get me back was to eat a tub of ketchup? Would you do it? I, I'd do it. I'd do it. I'd do anything to save you. Let's try these Jolly Rancher sour gummies. And we got one of each sour level. Level one, the Jolly Rancher gummy. Do you think that was sour? Out of one to five on a sour scale, that's a one. I don't think I take sour gummies very well. I thought sour that was like wise. a three out of five. This one's level two, tropical flavor. <laughs> that's a three out of five on the sour scale. I could have like a four. So these flavors are lime, blue oh raspberry. God, Look at that, guys. Bruh. Level three. Lime, blue raspberry, and balls black I cherry. I you are gonna say. I'm gonna go for the lime green. Lexi Snow for the blue raspberry. I like blue. I like blue. Together, that makes purple. purple. I don't, I don't, I think it makes it brown. brown. This is a one sour. This must be level three this sour. This is like nothing. Jolly Rancher, I'm gonna need to have a good word with whoever created this design. Eat this. Okay. Okay, analyze it. Analyze the sour. Why was that more sour? Exactly. I think the level three sour was the least sour. Level one was the middle. And level two was the most sour. Indian hot Cheetos. Uh, Flaming hot to be more specific. Oh God, that tastes awful. Oh God, hot!
The flavor's there. The heat is there. I can't eat it. If I was able to handle the spice, maybe I'd actually eat it. I don't like it anymore. <laughs> Poutine ruffle chips. I don't know what poutine is. Poutine, eh? Cheese and gravy. It smells like maple syrup. Actually, wasn't that bad. Honestly, I give it a six out of 10. We are on our very last oh. item. Also from Canada. I've been begging Lexi for the last three days straight to let me open this early. Cinnamon bun Oreos. They look like a normal Oreo. The stuffing looks so much better. out of 10. 11 yeah. out of 10. <laughs> good. Okay, yeah. I I'm so happy we saved, saved it for, for last. last. Yeah. But I'm also upset that we, we saved, saved it for, for last. last. Yes. Well, guys, we hope you enjoyed this week's video. I'm going to go and cleanse my palate right now. Out of all of these snacks that you saw here today, which one would you prefer to try? And if you have tried one of these, let us know in the comments below. Were we wrong about our opinions? Make sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, turn on those notification bells. And we'll see you guys next week. That's a wrap. I'm going to.